really, I was really looking forward to filming here, but I guess the lighting doesn't want to cooperate with me today, so I guess we're going to have to move somewhere else. Thanks a lot, universe. It's May. Let's just take a moment and for the curse you plane. Oh, goodness gracious, one moment. So today I'm going to be doing the back to school tag. So a few of my my friends on YouTube. Um, their names are Claire. Their username is Claire Maya. It's two girls, and they um, are at my school. They go to my school. They literally live around the corner. So they have a YouTube channel, and they just started YouTube a couple weeks ago. And the first video they did is the back to school tag. So I thought I'd steal that video idea with them and give them a little promotion. So I'm gonna link their channel down below. They make great videos, even though they only have one up right now. So yeah, you should subscribe to them and also subscribe to me, Self Promo. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna be doing the back to school tag. I think there's 13 questions and let's get into the video. Okay, so I have all the questions here on my iPad and um, or iPad mini and I'm gonna be telling you guys them. So, question one, what grade are you going into? This year, I'm going into the eighth grade, or grade eight, which we call here in Canada, and I this is my last year of elementary school, and I know if you're from the US, you're probably like, uh, grade eight is middle school, but we don't have middle school in Canada, or at least where I am from in Canada, so, to eight, and then, college or university or whatever. So I'm going into grade 8, which I'm 13. Question 2. What is your favorite and least favorite thing about school? Um, my favorite thing about school, I know most people are probably going to say like seeing recess or friends. Uh, my favorite thing about school is... I really like learning like things that I didn't know like were possible stuff like that and I love science class when we get to do all the science experiments I love doing that I'm not a huge fan of written work but you know who is right you might be no big deal I just not a huge fan of writing five paragraphs in French you know get me and my least favorite thing about school is who aren't very mature, you know who you are. Third question, what day do you go back? I go back this Tuesday, September 3rd, or September 3rd, September 8th, and it's depressing, but it's exciting because first day for me is the best day of the year. Come on, let's be real. At what time are you going to wake up? I wake up at 7.25 every morning because I babysit in the mornings, I know it's weird, but the little girl that I babysit, she comes over to my house every morning, she, I pretty much plop her in front of the TV, and she watches some TV while I get ready, and then I walk her to school. How long does it take you to get ready? It takes me probably about 30 to 40 minutes to get ready, because I gotta wash my face, do my makeup. What are you excited and nervous for? I'm excited to see all my friends that I haven't seen all summer that I really haven't my back that I really haven't kept in touch with but I'm nervous 
for, well, we have to get needles at school. Thank you very much, government. And um, so we get needles at school, so nervous for that, but who wasn't? Um, and, but I'm nervous for what my teachers are gonna be like, because I already know some of my teachers, but there's a new teacher at my school, and I don't know if I'm gonna have her this year. So if I am, I'm nervous, but maybe not. I don't know. Do you have a schedule yet? If show, if, if show, yes, if show. If so, share it. I don't get my schedule till the first day of school, sadly. Question number eight. Where do you normally purchase your school supplies? Well, last year and the year before I went to Target, but stupid Target decided that they would not spend enough time on the Canadian Target and they went out of business in Canada, so. Really, Target? You couldn't put your large brain of yours to work and figure out a way to keep it in Canada. I purchased all my school supplies this year at Staples and a tiny bit at Walmart. Question number nine, jeans, yoga pants, or skirts? Why isn't leggings a possibility is my question, but come on, let's be real. Everyone wants to wear yoga pants or like not yoga pants, like leggings. So I wear leggings, I wear like jeggings, and I never really wear skirts. Like, because the problem is in the winter, it's so cold and you can't like wear leggings under, really underneath because you're going to be freezing your buds off and you're walking to school, so. Backpack or purse? Backpack all the way. Woot, woot. Three must-have beauty items for school. I don't know if these count as beauty items or just like skincare. But I'm just going to make it one big category, okay? So my first thing that I need is my Clear Self Rapid Action Ultra Scrub. The next thing is my Voluminous Miss Manga Waterproof Mascara because, come on, you're at school for, what, six, seven hours and you don't want your mascara rubbing off. So I like this one and I'm wearing it right now and it's really good. And the next, last thing is cake. It doesn't really count as beauty, but like if to keep at school, like my um, Shea hand cream from the body shop. I actually got this from school for doing milk duty. I know that sounds so weird, but you like hand out the milk bins at my school. So I got this from the secretary for doing milk duty. So it's actually really good and I love it. So I like to keep that in my locker at school. What do you do in boring classes? This is an easy question. I doodle. I literally have notes and notes and notes of pages of doodling. Biggest tip for someone going into the grade you just completed. Okay, grade seven. Let's do this thing. How do people crack their knuckles? Oh, I cracked it. Oh, I don't know if you heard that. Grade seven is not that hard. Like, it's hard, but just try your best. Ask your teacher questions. If you are totally struggling with one part in like math class or French class or art class or whatever, because I know I suck at art, um, just ask your teacher because chances are she'll have the answer. So like she's not going to tell you the answer, but she's going to give you some good ideas on how to do good on your work and that would be fantastic. So that's all the questions. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great school year.